In this video, you'll see how a private 3 crypt walk-in mausoleum is constructed, including installation, interior design, and cemetery landscaping. Rome Monuments' Bill Happick, Jr. was the on-site project manager. This is a 3 crypt mausoleum. This style and size mausoleum normally holds 6 crypts, enclosed spaces where the casket of the deceased are placed. Walk through. The family chose to remove three crypts to provide a spacious interior area for prayer and reflection by multiple family members. Three stained glass windows. These stained glass windows depict religious themes and add beauty, interest, and symbolic meaning to the inside and outside of the mausoleum. The windows also allow more light into the interior space. Bronze door. The bronze door is an elegant feature often found in walk-in mausoleums. This one has a decorative bronze wreath and decorative handle. 51,000 pounds. The mausoleum is constructed of high-grade granite, a heavy, durable building material, with the outer surfaces at least four inches thick for maximum strength. There will be a landscape. Simpler the better is what we're going for. The landscaper leveled the ground, added trees, plants, grass, decorative rock mulch and garden borders, a path, as well as a bench and other details. It has Christian and Jewish symbols. Religious symbols were carved into the walls of the mausoleum as a way of expressing the family's faith. There are half columns. Two square granite fluted half columns decorate the front of the mausoleum. Half columns attach directly to the granite facade and can help support the pediment. The steel job, it's not polished. The family chose non-polished white granite with a matte finish for a softer, more natural look. It's ideal for mausoleums with a classical style. And it's all came pre-assembled, one piece. The mausoleum was designed and built by Rome Monument. The modules were pre-assembled in the factory for delivery to the cemetery. Uh, we're going to seal the bottom joint, put the steps in, seal them. The granite steps leading to the mausoleum entrance came from a reputable quarry in the United States. They are a welcoming addition, literally, to any walk-in mausoleum. On the morning of May 17, 2023, the crew, vehicles, and equipment met at the maintenance building at the Evergreen Hill Cemetery in Chagrin Falls, Ohio. After discussing the day's strategy, the 75-ton crane truck took the cemetery service road to the mausoleum plot. The larger lowboy truck carrying the mausoleum took the narrow, winding cemetery road to the plot. Coming around. The 75-ton crane truck hoisted the 26-ton mausoleum onto its foundation. Is that a good height to get your ice in there? That's pretty close. I'm gonna get the ice ready. Is that high enough? It should be just right on the wall. When a mausoleum is installed, 
It's lower than the cubes of dry ice to prevent breakage. As the dry ice melts, the mausoleum slowly lowers onto the concrete pad, and the joint between the mausoleum and foundation are sealed and waterproof. Just the hair, yeah, look at it. This way, oh, okay. I look real good right now. I don't know how about you guys look. Y'all let me know and I'll give John your direction. I'm perfect. Yeah, here, Herbie. The quick doors are installed. And the security lock is opened with the owner's private key. Very nice, really. A nice little private area back here. We gave them a little sitting area in case it's too hot inside. They can come back here and sit. That's about it, but this project's done, I'm happy to say. If you'd like more information on walk-in mausoleums, would like a quote, or wish to order a walk-in mausoleum, call or email a mausoleum professional at Rome Monument.